Let's smash his corpse. And vanish. Boop. Come on. There we go. So goofy. Frag grenade out. Before the shields? Ah, it doesn't matter. Actually, I don't think these shields even stop the grenade explosion, so it really doesn't matter either way. Up, up, and away into the Black Volker base. Journal entry, oh boy. I love those. Hey, Volker Patrol Droid. He looks like an assassin droid that we're gonna come across later. You I d why do droids make that noise when they die? I seriously don't know. Alright, let's uh, turn you on. Put you in patrol mode. Oops, didn't mean to do all that shit. Well, I'm out of parts now. Oh well. Oh my god, I don't... Sick dodge. So not worth the time to even pick up the mine. Hello, bouncer droid. Don't even care about loot, let's just kill him. Hello. Why is this skipping? Alright, well, we just... Oh. Car I try to kill her and then Karth is like, get out of here. I don't know why some dialogue is skipping. Oh well, I'm not gonna play for a ton longer, so I'll save that for next session. I'll try to find a fix. Sorry, I'm gonna stop now. My focus must like dubstep. Fucking thanks for the help, Sentry. You've really done a lot. Get out of the way, Karth. He perfectly put himself in a spot. Kill the cook. Oh, I like that. I, what I sometimes do is I just run down that hallway opening all the doors so that the guard droid that I, that I spawn comes in and kills everything. Oh my god. I just noticed how hurt I am. No. Yep. Like that. We're getting them. So that's the exit. We don't need it yet. Actually, I don't think you're allowed back in if you leave that way, so you literally have to circle the whole thing again. <laughs> Which is sucky in the extreme. Access the cameras. We want to be in the barracks. Let's overload the conduit so we can do this. Zap! There's six of the seven of them. And then this one's like, what the fuck, man? I hate my life, I lived. Never overload the terminal. I don't know why they give you that option, but it's literally just, hey, I want to kill myself instantly. It's so stupid. Hello. Ugh, sorry, I only That's fight to the death. death. This guy's like, hey, I'm a Volker, I just, I was an old Volker, don't hurt me. I don't know the codes to Brezhik's swoop garage, but just let me go. I don't like Brezhik, he sucks, he's a shitty new leader. He's turned us into these crazy assholes. It's like, well, I don't really care, sorry. Got a pass card, gotta kill you. Oh, he died fast. Repair kit. I love repair kits. Too bad I don't have droids yet. 
Oh yeah, this part's fun. Oh, I don't know if I have... I bet I don't, so I'm not gonna do it. Huh? Mission. You're expendable. Ba -ba 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 I'm here. So yeah. If you send the you can you can use repair parts to send the droid into the pool and he just triggers all those. But I'm not gonna because and admit the mines are invisible. I don't it doesn't matter what your awareness is, they're invisible. Um but yeah. If you send the droid and it just drives in there and explodes and it's like four at my skill level I think it would have been four repair parts, so just not worth it. Wow, mission's poison ran what? out just in time. I'm here. Insert the pass card. No reason to do anything else. You just do that. You get them really easy, and then turrets don't shoot you. Uh, can't do any more repairing. There's two droids in here to repair, which is kind of cool, but it's you kind of use a lot of repair parts too. So at this point, I'm not going to get anything. So what you do is I'm going to what I'm going to do is I'm going to Blitzkrieg over here, throw a grenade at you. I thought your guys would be closer, that's why I just did that. Yeah, you're going to die, so yeah, I'll just run straight over here. Got a level. Sweet. Don't even bother, just kill them. Nice kill. I am actually going to save those levels for a second. For a fight that's coming up. And I also want to touch that because I can get the garage head key card, which should. Uh, no. Okay. Security cameras, there's a garage. You set off an alarm. And the swoop bike starts going nuts. And these guys are. This guy. This is basically. Uh, this is, these guys actually always appear. Or these guys are already set, so if you do this, they come out here, and then they die to that. Instead of you having to fight them later. It's pretty convenient. There's the engine lab with people. Can't do anything. Loading bay. Can't do anything to that droid. Garage office. We could kill ourselves. <laughs> Which is so dumb. Security doors. Oh, you had remains. Cool. Wait. Nope. I also forgot about this footlocker. Hey, another computer spike. Already getting them back. Yeah, I'm gonna save the levels because that droid you saw in the loading dock is insanely tough. And then that droid is hostile. Owie. They can't hurt. As soon as I clicked attack, they both went nuts. That room has nothing in it. Let's fight this damn patrol droid. Do I have any? Ah, yes. I don't really need any of these anytime soon, so. Ow! So, this is why I saved the level. That's actually a really cool new ion grenade noise. So now if I level up, I should just do that, 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 and save the point. And now I'm at full health, so I can join in again. Didn't mean to do regular attacks, but probably better. Come on. I hate that carbonite beam. If he spams it, you just die you like that. Shit, I hate it. Always locks you down, always screws with you. God, Karth doesn't mean anything. Sure, let's just do saving throws what? are better. Oh my god, when he does this, you can almost guaranteed call your game just over. Karth, come on, hit him, hit him, hit him, hit him. Hit him. Holy shit. Okay, Karth. Throw an iron grenade before you die. It'll, that'll kill him. God, that's such BS. 
That stupid carbonite yeah. beam is the whole reason that thing sucks. I'm here. It's seriously. It's the only thing that makes it shitty. Done. Hyper battle. Alright, so now all we have to do is head down here, kill these black Volkers guarding this minefield. Man, they got slaughtered. I'm finally doing some damage myself, which is great. So now, all we have left is four rooms. And, uh, I think... Actually, I know what we're gonna do and then call it a day. So we're gonna kill this mechanic. And then he drops... Nothing. Okay. I thought for some reason he might have... Oh god, I don't know what I was just pressed, but I don't care. And then what we have over here is two guys... And they're dead, and then you can use the workbench. And this is like teaching you how to use the workbench, I don't know why. Okay, I can't upgrade those anymore. Ah, that was my one new one. Whatever, mission does more damage now. Which is great. And this is where those guys were. Those guys who came out to the explosion. Gaden's trying to steal the Rezik soup engine accelerator. Rezik stole. Hold on a second. You're right. I'm not one of the backs. You got my attention. You can't betray Gaden. No, that's not. They. They said I was too young. Well, yeah. Some of them were. But, but Gadden said Brezik... You're right. I don't need anyone but Zob. Ha ha ha. Rundi Hadong. That's what I will throw in there, you know. Are you sure about this? Alright, so we're gonna go kill Brezik now. Or Gadden. We're gonna go wipe out the hidden becks for the Volkers. And it's a good idea to clear out their whole base because you get kicked out as soon as uh, that happens. <laughs> as soon as you agree to that. Now, he said you could get 500 credits and the Republic Soldier, but. He, then he's like, well, I can't actually do that. What I have to do is I have to make you go and give them to, uh, or what is it? You have to go, whoever wins the swoop race gets her. And you get to run in the swoop race. And then you come out here. And once you agree to kill Gadden, he disappears. Gadden can't speak to you right now. Brezik's put a price on his head. I'm the assassin. Time to die. Zerdra, time to die. Like that, all the hidden decks. Let's do it, boys. No. Or girls and one guy. I can take you. What, you think you're good? Wow, 800. That was four times as much as the fucking rank war. Now, if you don't just do what I did. Uh, you have to get into that room, the control room, to get to Brett, to get to Gaden. And if uh, you damn. go in, they yell at you, and they're like, "Get out of here, or we'll kill you." And you have to go in there. Can I get in here? On it. Damn. Okay, so I have to go somewhere else. These doors are open. I didn't go in them, but if you come into the Hitbeck base, you can just go into these places. This this door and there's another door in the base, I think. They're also used for swoop-related cutscenes when you work for the Becks. Oh, what? It just security breach. I don't know if you saw that text, that's why I said it. Let's go! Hidden Becks are pretty good bitches. 
mean, we just wiped them out. I mean, we literally walked into their common room and were like, time to die. Oh my god, I don't care. If anything, that mine would have stunned me. That's it. I can live with being stunned for a couple seconds in exchange for not taking a million hours to deal with the mine. Where is Mission? Okay, she is here. What? For some reason, I felt like she was way far away. Sentry droid, why are you floating around over here? Pop. See, this is the best way to get loot, is to betray the... Totally wipe out the Volkers and then betray. Now, to the elevator is where uh, Gadden is, so what we need to do... Oh God, I don't even care about that. <laughs> Did no damage. Security breach! Even though we're being... <laughs> reverse security breach. They're trying to leave our secure lot area. Oh. Yeah, I gotta make my way to the control room. That way I can... Uh... If I head to the control room, I can open up the elevator so I can go kill Gadden. And then I think we'll actually call it a day after the swoop race. Because that's a really convenient stopping point. What the fuck? How am I supposed to get that open? Does this just open? I guess I can't enter the control room once the security breach happens. Okay, whatever. I'll just go up here. Who are you? You can't come in here. Sound Relax, Kira. This is an ally, not an enemy. You're too trusting, Gadden. These must be the assassins. Time for We're you to die, man. Guards, guards. Hey, Gadden, what's up? Nice shield. Oh, man, give me this sneak attack. Mm, that backstab. Can you move, please? Vibro double blade. Hey there. No, I'm not okay. trying to fucking talk to you. Memory package, I want that. Power belt? On it. Done. Done. 300. Not bad. Let's go. Sorry about that. Well, Gadden's dead. Let's go back to the, back to the Black Volkers. On it. Damn. So dumb. Okay. Well, they're locked in there, and the hidden backs are destroyed. So no skin off my back. <laughs> no skin off my nose. Ooh, power belt. I would love some intelligence boost. <laughs> um, and yeah, that's what I thought. Somehow she found. Somehow Gaddon didn't find out, but I did. But she did, that I had killed everyone inside. Don't ask me how, but they did. I'm just gonna go deal with this bounty, get some extra money. Don't need to be over there, don't need to be over there. Oh, and I have the serum. Sweet. You don't have to bargain, get to bargain with me. Fine. At least I can get that. Selvin Bendak is the only one. Alright, so we got the serum done. We got our bounty, so all we have to do is come back down here for one bounty later. 
And we have to come back down here anyway. Uh, very late, so we'll kill Bendek up. So we basically don't need to come back down here until we're ready to leave Taris. Once we go talk to the Volkers, of course. But yeah, then we'll just... Uh, so right now I'll just do the swoop race. And then... Uh, we'll get Bastila back, and then I will call it a day for this long-ass recording session. Because I am starving. I am so hungry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where's my other sword? Yeah, it's like the- so basically you can't run too many heats or the stupid accelerator explodes. Okay. <sighs> It's been a restless night in the Black Volker base. Hmm. Where only racers and mechanics can go. So basically, you're not allowed to have a party here. Which is fine. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -da. Forget it, let's just get to the racing. I don't care to talk to any of these losers. They just basically say, yay Volkers, or, or yay Bex. Okay, I want to race a heat. I don't know what the top time is, but I'm intentionally going to not go too fast. Because when you do this, left click on the... I don't want to do too good. Because, uh... What you, all you have to do is beat... Or is, uh, do okay right now. And as long as you beat the best time, you get uh, then your time gets beat, and then you have to beat that. So it's better to just not do amazingly right here. I mean, don't totally suck. Like I should still get the top time, and then my time's gonna get beat, and then I can crush that. Let's see. Yep, beat it. That's your excited thing, and then it's there's always one person who beats you from the other team. The accelerator is running fine, you run up to the race announcer, run another heat, and you win. I'm just gonna floor it, I'm gonna totally obliterate this now. Blair, blair. Okay, I tried to click on the dot, but whatever. If you hit those things, not these little boost pads, the things in the middle, that they slow you down, obvious, as you might expect, there are obstacles in the track. Notice how I just shaved off about six seconds. <laughs> Alright, that's an easy win. <laughs> 20 years of never seen anybody so good. One of the most daring riders in the Brezhik I, Brezhik, leader of the Black Volkers. I'm honored to award the victory prize to one of my own. Once again, proving the Volkers are the premier gang of Taurus. Well done. Through your skill and courage, you have proven yourself the premier swoop rider and brought great glory to the Black Volkers. That's why it is with the greatest sadness that I have to inform you of a slight change in the prize I am offering for you. What? When you hear what I have to say, you'll understand. It seems the woman I offered up as a prize is more than just a Republic officer. She's actually a Jedi. I've had to equip her with a neural disruptor collar to keep her mind in a state of unfocused confusion, just to make sure she doesn't use her force powers to escape. Obviously, I can't turn her over to you. It would be far too dangerous to have a Jedi as a slave. You can't do this. Fool. Your traditions are nothing to me. I am the wave of the future. If I want to withdraw the prize and sell this woman on the slave market, he I literally just said she can't be a slave. <laughs> Goodbye. Nice camera. What? Impossible. You are a You underestimate this. Focus to me. And then Brezik doesn't notice that hey, my my premier racer who just joined us is betraying me and killing me. 
Come on, Brezik. You wanna go? No, don't no, fight her. Fight me. Ooh, that backstab. <laughs> There's Bastila's lightsaber. Thank goodness we recovered that. Well, maybe those bloody Vulcas will think twice next time. Wait, I don't believe this. You're, you're one of the soldiers with the Republic fleet, aren't you? Uh... Save me. Is that what you were trying to accomplish? In case you hadn't noticed, I managed to free myself from that neural wrist. Brezik and his Vulcas would have left you for dead. Uh, no. The fight... Karth Nasi is alive. Finally, some good news. Maybe I misjudged you. Karth wouldn't have sent you if he wasn't confident in your abilities. Please, take me to Karth right away. Between the three of us, I'm sure we can figure out some way to get off this planet before the Sith realize we're here. Bastila, you're alive! Should have been Finally, a cutscene there. Finally, things are looking up. Now I just need to figure out a way to get off this planet. You mean you don't have a plan to get off Taurus yet? What have you been doing all this time? <laughs> Trying to get you. I see. Now that I'm back in charge of this mission, perhaps we can start doing things properly. Hopefully our escape from Taurus will go more smoothly than when you rescued me from Brezik. That hardly strikes me as an appropriate way of addressing your commander. My battle Oh my god, she's such a bitch. You know, I had my doubts about this mission, but... I see. It's true. First off, we can't... Well said, Carl. I think we'll need... It's something... When we met, it was like a vision. This is... It's true. I'm not sure it is possible. This isn't the first time I had a vision. Once we escaped... However... Look at Bastila's clothes. That's a cool robe. So we don't have anything to upgrade our lightsaber with, unfortunately. Nothing new, nothing new, nothing new. Hey there. I... It's complicated. I never knew we were Her brother sucks. I don't know the the only way see He gambled, he showed me how Hey, you don't I really He's a petty criminal. Why do you gotta go putting my brother down like that? He fell in Because he back. sucks. I don't want to talk if I'm gonna be okay. What is wrong with Zalvar? His eyes are purple, I swear. <laughs> okay, Zalvar doesn't fucking talk to you because he's a piece of shit walking How carpet. can I help? I would like to know what happened after you crashed. I managed to free myself. I'll admit that actually you're present. You all. Yes, I can see you do not lack an ability. <laughs> Although modesty is another matter. <laughs> perhaps, but the f it's obvious to me that the perhaps if you. Ah, uh, hopefully between your. Okay, well. Yes, what's on your. Oh, you want to argue? <laughs> Can't say I've ever met a woman quite like you before. <laughs> Just don't trust e Five years ago, it was completely unexpected. Okay, so the Jedi turned on us, and it's not because of them, it's because of his commanding officer named Saul. Uh, of Malak and Rev. The dark side had. I know. I'm. And I should have. It's just. Okay, so he's all distraught. So, anyway, for next time, we're gonna get off Taurus and uh, become a Jedi. But until then, my name is Timpeter, and I will catch you guys later.